And another cat hoarding situation to tell you about. This one in Yonkers, an estimated 200 cats inside a home on the city's southeast side. Rescue groups working with the homeowner to remove the cats in stages so no shelter is overwhelmed. Well, this as the SPCA of Westchester says that it is overwhelmed with support after rescuing cats from a separate hoarding situation. More than 150 of them removed from a filthy home in Yorktown one week ago. CBS 2's Tony Aiello reports the need for help keeps growing. This kitten, born Tuesday morning, just hours old, now part of the biggest cat rescue ever for the SPCA of Westchester, 151 cats and counting. We've had such an amazing response from the community, from people in our own backyard to across the country to overseas. The rescue from this filthy home in Yorktown made headlines around the world. Every one of these cats needs medical attention. Almost all have respiratory and eye infections. The vet bills will surpass $40,000. Hundreds of people have donated money, others giving bedding, kitty litter, and food. The SPCA says over the weekend, dozens of people stopped by to drop off supplies, many of them saying they're also interested in eventually adopting one of the cats. Some are going to take a few months to really recover and be able to go up for adoption. Others will hopefully be able to go up sooner. The story is heartbreaking on many levels. The homeowners, a male and female in their 50s, were found dead in a bedroom inside the decrepit home. Police have released very little information beyond saying foul play is not suspected. We've learned the man who died recently retired from the NYC Sanitation Department. One colleague telling me he was just a great guy, someone everyone turned to for help. None of us can understand this. Police believe the couple did their best but became overwhelmed. It's incredible if you could just have five, ten cats and they're not spay neutered, how in a year or two, how many dozens of cats that could accumulate. At the shelter, more kittens to come. This rescue, one of several that are pregnant. Tony Aiello, CBS 2 News. And the SPCA says the cats are well socialized and good candidates for adoption, which is unusual, they say, for a hoarding situation.